that is coming up God says it's very important he said there will be rejoicing and I hear favor and I hear victory he told me to title that fast as thanksgiving and right now as I was speaking in tongues he said the fast is important I heard the word favor, I heard victory, I heard rejoicing. All these fasting that God is making us do, there are reasons for them. Just like when he used to make me fast and I would not understand why, when he vindicated me, he talked about some of the fasting that I did. Like when I was going to Nigeria this year in March for Pastor Philip's program, he told me to fast for three days dry. I didn't know he was preparing me for a battle. And I didn't know that on the last day, the three day, I didn't know he sent an angel physically to strengthen me in the airport. I saw him and I know it's a guy that I saw, but I didn't know the guy was in an assignment to come strengthen me. So sometimes when God tells us to fast, it's like he's releasing a blessing or he's preparing us for something or something he promised us he's about to release it. I don't know. But there's going to be a three days fasting. Starting from Friday, which is tomorrow. You're going with my time, 6 a.m., which is a few hours from now. Less than 12 hours from now, we'll start. So if you have not eaten, go ahead and eat. But we're not going to eat from Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. At 6, we'll break it. You can drink water. If you did the seven days with me, you know that this three days is nothing. I announced it a few days ago, so you guys have been preparing for it. I heard victory. I heard rejoicing. I heard favor. So I don't know what God is planning, but everything is going according to God's plan. Even though the devil thinks he's in charge. Remember, God said, I fit it into my plan. It fit into my plan. So God is always the one in charge. I just feel a strong presence since I, since I watch her video. God said I should tell you that those who obey and do what he says they should do, there's a reward for them. But he says only a few will obey. Only a few will benefit because some people are still in doubt. God even said, some of you that get the book, you still don't believe anything. You just got the book. You have to change your mindset if you want to receive from God. You got to believe. Because if I don't believe in God, God will not use me. If I don't believe what God tells me to say or do, I will not see any result. If I type a prayer for somebody, I believe that that prayer will work. And they come back with testimony. But if I doubt the prayer, then there will be no testimony. You see what I'm saying? 
So if you want something to happen for you, Rada Baro, she bring it in the show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No man, I can't make it in the Zuga da Baja. Yeah, 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 yeah. Man, I'm all Zindi, man, I'm all Udo Dosa. And he said, when you read that book, you read it with respect because you are reading the word of God. God said, I should tell you. I should tell you. That when you read that book, the vindication book, the way you respect the Bible, That she's been sitting here. I have been the one speaking. Not her. I am God. <laughs> I am blended in Melema. <laughs> Even that song yesterday. I sang that song. <laughs> Vindication is my book. I gave it to her as a gift to this world. <laughs> Soon you will see how people will be looking for this book all over the world. <laughs> I will show it to them in dreams. I will make them get it. And those who believe, I will work miracles in their lives. I gave it to her. She would not even need to do deliverance and healing on many people. When they get the book and they believe, I will deliver them. I will heal them. I will restore them. They have to believe. To not put this book in dirty places. If you don't have anywhere to put it, put it up on a shelf. Treat the book the way you treat the Bible. Value the book. <laughs> I am watching. <laughs> I am watching. Some of you, when you begin to read the book, <laughs> I will show you a vision. <laughs> the way you read the Bible, and I give you understanding. I will give you understanding when you read this book. 
I will even show you a vision of what happened. <laughs> this is my book. Why do you think people are ordering so many? <laughs> There will be more. There will be millions of others. <laughs> All over the world. <laughs> Even people with coronavirus. <laughs> if they get a book and they believe I will heal them instantly. They will walk out of that hospital like nothing ever happened to them. And this includes those that are already using that thing the thing for breathing incubator the moment they touch it if they believe I will heal them they don't even need to open it they just need to touch it and believe they will get up from there the book will raise the dead I will do miracles I will do things I am God Belema is not the one speaking. I am speaking. I have taken over this place. I don't want to see you misuse this book. If you don't have anywhere to put it, put it on the shelf. Treat it the way you would treat me, God. It's a book of power. <laughs> Many more things will happen as you get your books. Sometimes I will wake you up at night to go read the book. And you will begin to cough and vomit. I will use the book to deliver people. Just the way you were using the water that she blesses. I have put power in this book. Even more than any water she has blessed. You don't know what you have bought. You don't know what you have. If you know, you will not play with this book. This is my book. People will buy in boxes. <laughs> I will anoint people through this book. Some people will be anointed as they read this book. Ha, ah, you heard the little girl. <laughs> I will perform wonders with this book. Some people will use this book in their house just to lay it on somebody and the person will be instantly healed. <laughs> Even the blind will see with this book. There are many people that will appear to them in their dreams. I will tell them that once they get that book and believe I will heal them. <laughs> I did it with that lady. <laughs> I will advertise the book myself. I am God. Hmm. People will be fighting to get a book. At some point, people will be fighting to get a book. <laughs> you are fortunate that she's signing your book after now she will not do that again I 
will announce my daughter myself I will use her mightily <laughs> there will be so many unusual miracles She has the power to destroy anyone she chooses. I showed her. She just needs to raise her hand and they will die. <laughs> From today, you have to be careful around her. Zero tolerance. Why do you think I put her mom to be a supervisor? She is powerful. I have given her access to many things that others cannot have access to. Be careful when you work with her. Do not grieve her spirit. She is powerful. From today, you have to act right. Gone are those days where people will be talking nonsense about Belemar and getting away with it. <laughs> she has entered a new dimension. And in this dimension, there is no time for foolishness. People will die if they speak evil of her. Even if they think evil of her, they will die. I have been showing her dreams but she doesn't understand even during the seven days fasting I showed her a lot of dreams people were dying people who spoke evil of her I always show her things but many times she doesn't understand but I am coming here to announce it myself she has suffered a lot in the hands of people but not anymore <laughs> you would need to be careful You see Belema, you see power. When she walks, even when you walk the past where she just passed, you will receive. I have decorated her with power. I have anointed her. <laughs> She's ready for whatever comes. No man can bring her down. She can mock them and nothing will happen to her. Nothing will happen to you too that is connected. It's one thing to be watching the videos and it's another thing to be connected. Some of you are just watchers. I don't count you as members. 
just like the fasting. Some of you would not do it. <laughs> you could see a lot of followers, but I don't count all of them. I know those who are mine. So if you are not connected, be careful how you talk about these people because they will come after you. But those who are connected to this ministry, I will protect them. Because some of you are still all over the place. So I don't count you as one. Those men are dangerous. Those false prophets. Their goal is to destroy. People don't speak against them because they are afraid of them. But in this ministry, Belema and her members can speak against them and nothing will happen to them. Because I'm the one allowing it. I'm using this ministry to mock them. Because they have mocked me for so long. They have used my name for evil for so long. So I raise Belema for this battle. And nobody, no man can stop her. She will do more to them. <laughs> she hasn't even started. When they hear her name, they will run. A lot of them will come to her for prayers. <laughs> A lot of false prophets will come to her for prayers. She will deliver a lot of them. Because they will watch how she will bring a lot of people down. And they will have no choice but to run to her. Belema will destroy a lot of shrines. It doesn't matter the power that are lying to fight her. They will all fail. They will not succeed. When she's here signing the book, you think she's the one signing it? I am the one signing it. That's why when the little girl put her hand on the right hand, she felt something. <laughs> I'm the one doing these things through her. I have told you before. I am the one doing these things through her. I gave her an assignment to tell you to read a page or two. I always tell her to tell you things. Some of you, you don't follow instructions. She tells you do the video horizontal. You grieve her spirit and you still do what you want to do. The ones who obey and do it right, I will bless them. The moment she watched that lady's on, she started to feel tingling because I am pleased with that lady. You don't know why I brought you to this ministry. You think you are here to come watch video and laugh every day? <laughs> don't waste your time acting stupid. Don't waste
waste your time acting foolishly. I brought you here to learn, to receive, to love me, to grow. Because I have plans for you. Can't you see how you are learning at the comfort of your home? Are you paying for this? Did you travel for this? You are in your house. And you are receiving all this for free. I did this. So don't come here acting foolish. I see everything. When she say don't post something. I am the one telling her. But you keep doing it. And you think it's her. If she says she doesn't like something. I am the one telling her. Don't do it. Because if you grieve her, you would not like it. I am God. If I am leading you to get the book, get the book. If I am leading, it, leading you to get it for somebody in your family, get it for somebody in your family. Some of you have traveled many places looking for healing and deliverance. If I show you to get the book, get it. And if you believe, I will deliver you. I will heal you. How do you explain that? How do you explain somebody putting the book on their belly and they are vomiting, they are peeing? Is that what a demon will do? Can't you see that I am with Melema? This book will bring a lot of people to me. A lot of people will read it and repent. It has to go all over the world. It will go all over the world. She doesn't have to do anything. But people will get it. Some pastors will get it for all their members. I showed it to her. Some people will get it in thousands of copies. Some people will get it and as they pass it out, there will be deliverance taking place. It will humble a lot of people. I am God. And every word that I have spoken today will come to pass. Some of you that are here with her, you will not be here when I take her far. But you are privileged to be here now. Learn all you can learn. Very soon, it will be hard to have access to her. I have said this before. Learn all you can learn from her. I will use a lot of you mightily. I just wanted you to learn from her. Don't learn from those false prophets. Otherwise you will be like them. Learn all you can from her. Learn from her. Thus saith the Lord. Thank 
you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Beautiful day.